advice would you give to a 15 year old that wants to make it in the pros? I think the kids need to know that the business of pro sports is rough and unfair and political and the best don't always get to the top. How do kids and parents go in with their eyes wide open and be prepared for the unfairness and the corruption? I think, first off, um, you know, you can do your research. Um, you know, my father was really big into Baseball America. It gives you a lot of information. Um, and you have this kind of idea that all the clubs are working against each other. They're trying to have the best talent. But once you learn that the different teams collude and they really have control over a player's fate, um, to go against that is counterproductive. At the end of the day, you as a player want to be successful. You as a parent want to give your child the best opportunity to be successful. So the best thing you can do is prepare them with building true confidence, especially if you get drafted, if you're good enough to get drafted, and, and you sign that contract and you go to play. It's easy to recognize who the prospects are, and who the non-prospects are. And I think the majority of the guys will get down on themselves when they realize that um, it's what they call filler, that they're a filler player just out on the field to really develop those prospect players. So I think to be able to prepare your child for the realization that you really need to be able to perform um, and you also need to be able to read a situation um, so that you can make a, an educated decision. Obviously, it's your dream, it's what you love, it's what you want to do. Um, but, you know, I think at some point we all have to be realistic. A, a great example, a high school buddy of mine, John Clark, he was drafted in the fourth round, uh, got really, really good money uh, out of high school. He went and played a year and a half of professional baseball. Here was a guy drafted in the fourth round, but he recognized very, very quickly that there was a prospect that was a shortstop that was above him, and he was filler. And so he moved on with his life, and he became a pastor, and now he's an engineer, and he's, you know, so I guess the reality is baseball is a great sport to teach life lessons, but once you get into professional baseball, it, it is a business. And um, to be able to take that mature, perspective of this is a business, if you're not going to move up, you should probably find something that uh, will help you and your family be successful together. Go to sportsmentaltoughness.com to get your free video training and guided visualization mp3 on how to perform under pressure. I'm Craig Sigal, the Mental Toughness Trainer.